Come on, you can do better than that, he yelled, his voice echoing around the cavernous room. The second jet of light hit him squarely in the chest. The laughter had not quite died from his face, but his eyes widened in shock. Harry released Neville, though he was unaware of doing so. He was jumping down the steps again, pulling out his wand as Dumbledore to turn towards the daze. It seemed to take Sirius an age to fall. His body curved in a graceful arc as he sank backwards through the ragged veil hanging from the arc. Harry took the look of mingled fear and surprise on his godfather's wasted once handsome face as he fell through the ancient doorway and disappeared behind the veil which fluttered for a moment or so in a high wind, then fell back into place. I don't know how the chorus goes, but this is really sad. Harry heard Bellatrix's triumphant scream, but knew it meant nothing. Sirius had only just fallen through the archway. He would reappear from the other side any second, but Sirius did not reappear. Sirius, Harry out, Sirius. I thought that maybe singing it would make it funny or something and less sad, but instead it just sort of had the effect of having a really badly sung yet still sad soundtrack. I have an announcement. Ezra has left the building of the Elements 3. Building. I, I shouldn't use metaphors. Yeah, me and Eliza are still figuring out what's going to happen, but in the meantime we're just going to keep making videos because making videos is fun and we like it. Except for when you make me sing death scenes. I don't like it then. We're going to take an unexpected journey into this week's theme and talk about the Hobbit movie. Yay! I went and saw the Hobbit movie yesterday and it was really good and I liked it a lot. I haven't read the book. The books. Is there more than one Hobbit book? I suck. I, I, I suck. I suck a lot. I, I really, really suck. Now that that's established, the movie is good. I really like it. I want to be friends with Bilbo and have tea parties with him because I think he's cool and that would be fun. Martin Freeman is awesome and everything and this wasn't an exception. And I like all the dwarves. They were cool. They had really good moustaches, a lot of them, which, is a, which just makes any movie good when it contains epic moustaches. It was quite a long movie, which mostly I don't like, but with this one it didn't really matter because I didn't get bored. So in conclusion, I thought it was a spiffing movie. You should all see it if you want to. I, yeah. If I sound upset, it's because of Sirius dying. Goodbye.